Bridget Bardo, the iconic actress and animal rights advocate, has left a lasting mark on popular culture. While she's renowned for her cinematic and advocacy work, there's more to her story that's worth exploring. One intriguing aspect of Bardo's life is her inclusion in Billy Joel's 1989 song We Didn't Start the Fire, where she is among the four surviving individuals mentioned by name. The others are Chubby Checker, Bob Dylan, and Bernhard Goetz. This reference in a famous song underscores her enduring presence in the public consciousness. Bardo's personal life also holds its share of complexities. Her estranged son Nicholas, married to Anne Line Birken, a daughter of a Norwegian diplomat, has two daughters, Anna and Thea. As of 2009, Bridget has had no contact with her son or granddaughters. She only met them once in 1992 during a family gathering organized by her husband, Bernard de Ormel. In a surprising turn of events, Bridget became a great-grandmother in February 2014 when Anna gave birth to a girl. While these aspects of Bardo's life may not be as well known as her acting and animal advocacy, they add depth to her story and show the multifaceted nature of this cultural icon. Bridget Bardo's life is a tapestry of experiences, from her public presence in music to the complexities of her family relationships, making her a fascinating figure in the world of entertainment and personal history. Bridget Bardo, the iconic actress and animal rights advocate, led a life filled with fascinating connections. Her personal relationships extended beyond marriages and live-ins, including names like Warren Beatty, Gilbert B. Codd, Sacha Distel, Nino Fur, Sami Frey, Serge Gainsbourg, John Gilmore, Jimi Hendrix, Christian Kalt, Luigi Rizzi, Michael Sarn, and Laurent Verges. One remarkable aspect of her life was her close friendship with fellow sex symbol Claudia Cardinale, with whom she co-starred in The Legend of Frenchie King. However, Bardo's family life was not without its controversies. She had a son named Nicholas Jack Cherrier, but he was raised by his father's family and had little contact with Bardo until adulthood. In 1997, Nicholas successfully sued Bardo over descriptions in her memoirs, where she referred to him as a tumor and expressed a preference for giving birth to a dog. The lawsuit centered on privacy violations, resulting in Bardo paying 17,000 euro in damages. Bridget Bardo's life was a tapestry of complex relationships and personal experiences, making her a captivating figure in both her personal history and her contributions to popular culture and animal advocacy. As we draw the curtains on this cinematic journey, it's only fitting to take a moment to reflect on our personal connection with the iconic actress Bridget Bardo. Her presence on the silver screen has been nothing short of mesmerizing leaving an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Whether you were enchanted by her alluring beauty, captivated by her talent, or simply inspired by her charismatic allure, Bardo's influence has transcended generations. Now, I invite you to share your cherished memories and thoughts about her performances. What was the movie or role that resonated with you the most? How did Bridget Bardo's artistry touch your life? Your unique perspective adds another layer to the tapestry of her enduring legacy. Bridget Bardo, with her grace and charm, redefined the very essence of screen presence, setting a standard that continues to inspire actors and artists worldwide. Her work in films has not only entertained but also served as a testament to the power of cinema to evoke emotions, provoke thought, and ignite our imaginations. As we bid adieu to this reflection on Bridget Bardo's remarkable career, I express my heartfelt appreciation for your time and interest. Thank you for joining us on this cinematic journey and for sharing your thoughts. Together, we celebrate a true luminary of the silver screen, actress Bridget Bardo, and her lasting impact on the world of entertainment.